Hey guys, Kim Wolf here with AffiliateMarketingInformant.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Vidnami video in Pictory. Now, if you haven't heard by now, Vidnami is going away. So we have been in search of good Vidnami alternatives, and this is one you should definitely check out. And if this video helps you out, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. We'll be more than happy to help you out. And be sure to download our free step-by-step -step user guide where I document all of these steps for you to help you once you're inside of Pictory so you know exactly how to create a very simple Vidnami-like video inside of Pictory. And you'll find out about any special offers that we know about. And at the time of this video, there is definitely a special offer happening right now, so be sure to grab this guide. Okay, so this is how this video is going to be structured. First off, I'm gonna talk about Pictory's features and how they stack up to Vidnami, highlighting the features that you want if you are a former Vidnami user. Secondly, I'm going to create a video in Vidnami. And then third, I'm going to create the same video in Pictory. So you can watch me create the exact same video in each video maker and see why Pictory is a close Vidnami alternative right now. And heads up, before we even get into this video, I just want to give you a full warning that there is no exact replacement for Vidnami. Unfortunately, there is no one product that does exactly everything Vidnami does or did as well as it did it. Now, let's talk about the features that Pictory does have. Pictory is an AI video maker, so therefore it does have the auto clip selection that you're gonna be looking for to make it really easy to create videos quickly and easily. Pictory also has auto voices, 13 of them, so you can choose an auto voice versus using your own. They also have a wide library of background music that you can append to your video, just like Vidnami. They support different video formats, just like Vidnami. And this is going to be the horizontal format, the vertical format, or even the square format. They do support the 1080p export option. This is going to be a premium plan feature. The premium plan will also offer you brand customization options, which will allow you to add things like your logo and standard intros and outros. You can upload your own media, voiceover, and music. And the Pictory plans do come with unlimited videos creation. Now, Pictory does not have all of the features that you are used to in Vidnami. And keep watching because I'm actually going to call those out as I create the Vidnami-like video inside of Pictory. Or if you want the list right now, definitely be sure to go download the user guide, the description below in the link, where I actually list out all of the differences so you know exactly what to expect and what not to expect. Okay, now we are going to do the Pictory versus Vidnami comparison video. Now we're going to start with the video inside of Vidnami. So if you do not want to see this, then definitely refer to the chapters in the description of this YouTube video. And you can skip forward to where I make this exact same video inside of Pictory. But I want you to see step by step on how they compare and how they don't. So in Vidnami, I'm going to come to the create a new video option. And then I'm going to go through Vidnami's process to actually create a really quick and easy video. So I'm just gonna leave it on the content video format template, which is what you choose at first. I'm gonna choose the cool blue template. Then I'm going to paste a script in here. And if you want the script to test out, then definitely download my user guide. I've actually got it linked in there for you to give you a really easy and quick script that you can use to save yourself time so you don't have to write out a script just to test out Pictory. Now that I've pasted my script, now we're going to go to the scenes, and this is where Vidnami does its AI and its auto clip generation, where it automatically creates a video for us, right? And this is going to be where you actually enhance or edit each scene as you want. So some of the popular options are to come here and actually use these words that are auto populated for you to find different images that you can actually use. And at any point, you can choose any of these images to use in this scene instead of what it auto populates. Then you scroll down and check the scenes, right? And at any point, you can come in here and you can edit words and you can edit the highlighting as well. Your scene options allow you to do some popular things like hiding the text, bolding and underlining the different parts of your captions, moving the caption to different positions, adjusting the background, and easily linking the previous scene using the same media layout in motion. And if you decide you don't like the screen, you can delete. We're gonna say that it's good as is, and we're gonna move on to the voice. So here's going to be one of the differences that you're gonna notice in Pictory. In this case, we're gonna keep things simple and just use one of Pictory's auto voices. But in many cases, affiliate marketers and online marketers that use Vidnami and even creative agencies like to either record their own voice track 
or upload a voice track for the video. We're going to go with Kate. Now we're going to preview our video. And depending on how long the video is, this particular step in the preview part can take a few minutes. So we will wait patiently as Vidnami does its thing. Now that the preview is generated, we can celebrate different background music. You can also upload your own music, as you know. And then if you come to options, this is where you have some additional options to adjust the music volume the track volume, and even the voice track speed. Hit preview again since I made some adjustments, and it's going to create another video preview for me. You can come down here and actually play the video, and then when it looks good, you continue, in which Vidnami will actually create and generate your video. And this is an option that most of us use. We actually like to come in here and change the resolution to full HD ADP, which does take slower times to generate, larger file sizes, but higher quality videos. Then we generate video and Vidnami does its thing once again. So this is going to be the process of creating a video in Vidnami. And one of the reasons why it was such a favorite, because you really could spend very little time creating pretty high quality videos with minimal work. Now Vidnami has finished actually creating my video. I'm going to choose download to download it to my desktop. Then I'm going to open it and play you the example so you can see what Vidnami creates versus Pictory. Now I'm going to actually jump into Pictory and show you how to create this exact same video inside of Pictory. The one thing that is unique about Pictory is that you will actually get more options on how you can create your videos than you had inside of Vidnami. So this should offset some of the things that you may not get inside of Pictory that you got into Vidnami and that you may be used to. Now to keep this video very simple, I'm going to do the exact same steps that I just did in Vidnami. Now in order to create the video just like we did in Vidnami, here's what you do. You're going to choose the second option, which is the script to video. Choose start. Then we're going to paste in our script just like we did in Vidnami. Once again, you can grab this script just to use for quick testing in the user guide available below. Then you're going to choose proceed. This is where you're going to choose the actual format of your video. Whether it's going to be landscaped, portrait, or square. We're going to do landscape because that's what I chose inside of Vidnami. Now Pictori is actually creating the video like it did in Vidnami. So here we go. It auto-generated a video choosing its own images and text for captions in each scene. So this is a similar view, but not exact to Vidnami. Now you have similar editing options where you can come to each scene. You can double click to actually edit, highlight any keywords that you want. Now this is going to be one of the differences that the highlighting feature is not as smart as Vidnami, which means you may have to do a little bit more manual highlighting than you're used to. You can delete the scene. You can actually preview the scene alone. You can trim the video. Now this is going to be specific to the premium plan. And you can add your voiceover to this particular scene. You have additional settings over here where you can hide the text. So in this scene, I can take the text away, which was a popular feature in Vietnami. You can also turn off the voiceover and have no sound. And you can also turn off the background music and have no sound. And then you can also either turn on or off the visual zoom and pan. So that's all going to be in the settings tab for you inside of Picturey. Now, if you want to change the images, this is going to be another thing that's slightly different in Pictory. So you want to make sure you have the scene selected that you want to edit. So in this case, anything in blue means you're editing that scene. So this is going to be the image that's going to show for this very first scene, which is how to win with affiliate marketing. You're going to come to the visuals tab here, and this is where you're going to select different images based on what you are looking for. Now there's a couple differences here because you're not going to see any auto-populated tags where it tries to define the tags and actually show the images for you. However, it is showing related images. As the AI detects that my video is about business and industrial, so it's got me inside of that category and showing me similar videos in that category that they think that I might like for this particular scene. For the example video, I really like this one, so I'm going to choose on this. This is going to be another difference that you're going to see inside of Pictory versus Vidnami. Vidnami pulled its stock videos and images from Storyblocks and other free image sources. Pictory actually pulls its stock videos and images from Shutterstock and Storyblocks. So in your preview videos, you're going to see the Shutterstock logo. But do know that once you actually create and generate the video, the Shutterstock watermark will not be apparent. So don't be alarmed when you see this watermark because it will not be in your video, even on the free plan. 
Another difference is going to be the auto clip selection. It's not quite as smart as Vidnami is, meaning that you really need to come through here and actually check the scene to make sure you're happy with the results. So in this case, I really want successful to be the keyword opposed to affiliate marketing. So since I have this scene selected, you can see that here, I'm gonna come here and actually choose successful and see what comes up. You know, I'm looking for more of a happy, like really excited image. So one important tip is to actually come here and change your categories to all categories. This is going to widen the categories that it looks for successful people. This is kind of a cool one. Let's we'll select that and see if we like that. She's kind of happy. She looks successful. We could also try to do something like happy guy. I'm not sure how a cat playing with a real or fake spider is a happy guy. There's a guy with money. That's pretty cool. I'm kind of looking for a person bursting with excitement. So let's try as excitement. That's kind of cool. He's kind of pointing to, do you want to be a successful marketer? Not exactly what I was looking for, but you kind of get the drift. Here's one that may actually work. Or even this one. No, she's running. Maybe we could do something cool like that. But you're getting the idea, because this step's gonna take a little bit more work than you're used to in Vidnami. However, it's important to know that according to Pictory CEO Vikram Chalana, the auto selection will get smarter over time inside of Pictory. So in the meantime, you can use the search similar option as we are doing here, or you can enter in your additional specific keywords in the search box like we did here. But do know that over time, you should see some improvements on the AI and the auto selection process. Now let's do this for one more scene and see if we're happy with this. So if you're starting with Affiliate Marketing 2021, good for you. Let's try something like 221, show something in the year for the excitement. So we'll choose that instead, which is a simple click of the video. And if you see any videos that you think you might like to use at a later date, you can always star them so they will show up in your favorite selection. Now the cool thing is at any point you want to preview this video, you can by choosing this option here. You don't actually have to go through all of these options just to get to the preview. But let's continue going through the process and choose audio. Now this is where you're gonna choose your two types of audio. First off being the background music. At any point you can come here and choose this little play button and it will actually play the song for you. So you can preview it and see if it's one you wanna use for your video. When you're ready, you just simply select it and it's gonna be highlighted like this. So that has appended that background music to my picture video. Now you're gonna to come to the voiceover section and just like Vidnami, Pictory has 13 different voices that you can choose to use for auto voices. In the same scenario, you can come here and you can actually choose the little play button and hear a preview of each voice. Now, some are saying that these voices do seem a little bit more robotic compared to the voices that were actually in Vietnami. So one tip to make these sound a little bit less robotic is to actually increase the speed to at least 105 to somewhere between 110. So we'll go with a female UK English voice and we'll choose Emma for our video. Once you select the voice, you'll see the applied symbol here, which says that you applied this voice to your video. Now we're gonna to go to styles, and this is essentially the template section that you start off with in Vidnami. You just get to this step later in the process versus starting out with it. But these are the different templates and themes you can choose. Choose this one and it will automatically apply to your video. To choose the theme you want and the colors you like, then come up to scene transitions. So this is where you can have different scene transitions that can either circle in or out, fade, blur to the right, bar, white bottom to top, etc. This is an additional feature that you get inside of Pictory that you did not get inside of Vietnami. And the last step is to confirm the format. So you chose this in the beginning, but the most important step here is to actually choose your video resolution. Now know that the 720p is going to be available in the standard plan. If you have the free or the premium plan, you will have this additional 1080p option. 
but that is going to be for the premium pay plan, not in the standard plan. Now I have essentially created my Vidnami-like video inside of Picturey, and I'm going to come up here and choose Preview and actually preview the video. So just like Vidnami, this is going to take some time, especially the longer the video is and the bigger it is, the more time it's going to take. And if you use the free plan, you are going to have Picturey branding on the video. You will need to buy a paid plan to get rid of the Picturey branding, just like in Vidnami. Once the preview looks good, you're now going to generate the video. This is going to be one more place where you're going to see some additional options that you weren't used to inside of Vidnami. For Vidnami-like videos, you're simply just going to choose the video option. But if you have the premium plan or higher, you actually have additional options where you can export these videos into a spreadsheet for social posts and also create them for Hootsuite, which is a well-known and popular social media publishing platform used by many, many marketers today. But for this video, we're just going to choose video to create a Vidnami-like video. And Pictory is going to do its thing and create our video. And just like Vidnami, this can take a little while depending on how big your video really is. Now Pictory has finished generating my video. So it's going to give me the options to download or copy links and share. It is saved under my projects now. And you also see I have a notification here where I can go and do other videos and it will let me know when the video is ready to download. I'm gonna choose download here and it's gonna put it on my computer just like Vidnami. Then we're gonna open it up and preview it so you can see how Picturey creates a very similar video, but not exact. And don't forget we added some additional transition options that you have inside of Pictory that you may not have in Vidnami. So that's why you had sort of the fading in and out, but you can turn that off if you want. If you are interested in seeing the full examples, we have posted them on our YouTube channel. I will include them in the links below in the description. You can go watch the full one minute of the Pictory video example versus the full one minute of the Vidnami video example. Now don't forget that Pictory does not have all of the features that Vidnami did. A couple of the missing features that some people have been complaining about right now are the fact that you cannot upload an entire voiceover to the entire video. So if you go to the My Uploads option, for background music you will see the option to upload your own music and the background music will be applied to the entire project. But if you go to upload your own voiceover, you'll see that the voiceover will only be applied to the current open scene. So as of right now, the best way to do voiceover is to actually record voiceover for each scene. And that is going to take some additional time for you. For the people that have tried that, they definitely said it's more time, but it works okay right now. However, do know that this feature is planned, it's on the roadmap, according to the Pictory team. At some point, you will be able to upload the voiceover to apply it to the entire video. An additional missing feature is going to be the merge and split scenes. So you can't currently do that. The only option you have is to actually add and insert a scene, but you can't merge them together. Now, Pictory is a little bit different in its pricing structure. With Bidnami, you had one monthly plan at one price for all features. In Pictory's case, you actually have multiple plans. The plans you're going to toggle between are going to be the standard and or the premium plan. The prices are going to vary depending on whether you pay on a monthly basis or a yearly basis. And in order to get the comparable features to what you are used to in Vidnami, you are going to choose the premium plan. However, be sure to download our free guide below because in that I will have special offers for you that we know about. There are several in the works right now at the time of this video, so make sure you grab this guide now and the most appropriate best offer for you will be in the guide. So definitely go grab my guide right now. So I hope this video has helped you out. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment to this video. Definitely appreciate your support. And keep watching our channel for additional Vidnami alternatives as we take the time to research them and compare them to Vidnami to try to find the best alternative for you. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.